This book is dedicated to Jim Williams, who did by far the majority of work in both the circuits and the writing, period. One of the, the nice things about Jim Williams' writings is that he enjoys explaining how things work in detail and explaining how you measure the performance of circuits in detail and allows you to duplicate the electrical performance on your own. One of the more important things is what can go wrong when you're building a circuit and that's also shown in a lot of his sheets. As far as I know, most of the other manufacturers' application notes don't go nearly as far in providing a tutorial for analog design. And to be a good analog designer, it's really important to have lots of examples, either done by you or read about it being done by another person um, as a learning tool. In the time I knew Jim, and he's sorely missed now, he never refused to help a student either getting parts or getting a circuit running because he thought it was really important to help the students enjoy the analog circuitry that they were working on. Out of the schools today, there's a majority of students coming out with software and digital design degrees compared to analog. And if you decide to go into analog, you'll find it's very productive, fun, and difficult.